Ang programang ito ay rated SPG. Striktong patnubay at gabay ng magulang ang kailangan. Maaaring may masiselang tema, lengguahe, karahasan, sexual, horror o droga na hindi angkop sa mga bata. Hello everyone, thank you for tuning into my channel. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Love thy woman today. Uh, you know, it's kind of slowing down. It's The show sh should have got a lot more done than what got done today. Uh, first we start off with uh, Kai still in jail. Uh, you know, the police believe her story that, you know, she's innocent and Lucy's the one behind all this stuff. So, uh, the investigators go back to the office. They're telling them, you know, you can't really go through the building. Uh, stay out of Adam's office. Uh, G, uh, Lucy gets a phone call and they're talking about the gun. So, Lucy goes, she gets the gun. She's freaking out. She don't know what to do with the gun. Uh, she, she calls Manny. She's talking to Manny. She says, can you help me? I need some help. What, what can I do to get rid of this gun? And, uh, you know, he's like, they cut, cut that part off. I think he's going to tell her how to, how to try to get rid of it. But she, uh, earlier she goes out to the garbage outside. She knows they're all watching her. She knows that the police are everywhere. She throws out a regular garbage. There's nothing in it. She goes back in the office. She gets the gun. Uh, she takes it in the women's bathroom. She pulls out a whole bunch of napkins and she put the, you know, for wash your hands of the tissues and packs the gun up there and then puts tissue underneath of it. And as soon as she walks out, the guards go in there and, you know, the police do. They don't find nothing. And she's talking to Dana. Dana, Dana, you gotta go see if they got the, found the gun. Dana doesn't want to do it, but she, she agrees with her mom. She goes into the bathroom Feels her hand up. There's a couple little holes in the slots where you pull out your tissues. And she says, oh, I can, I, I felt the gun. She leaves it there. She tells her mom. And her mom's like, oh, they're not that good. The police aren't that good of investigators if they didn't find the gun. But um, what's going to happen, the investigators are looking through everything. And I, I believe they, they put these cameras. They put these cameras on the computer. So... They're going to, you know, watch the video of Lucy saying about the gun. And that should be tomorrow the next day. But uh, um, Lucy's, you know, the, the, the uh, lawyer saying, you know, we're going to read the last will and testament of uh, Adam. And so they're sitting in the office and they're waiting. They're waiting for Gia to show up. Gia really doesn't want to go, but... David talks to her and says, you know, you need to go and see what's going on. You know, she is just worried about starting her own business again. And, uh, uh, you know, she's having a hard time finding a job. Uh, David and them offered her a job, but she doesn't want it. She says, if I don't find a job in 30 days, I'll go work for you. But uh, David talks to her into going to uh, Dragon Empires to hear the lawyer speak now. That's where it kind of cuts off. Uh, Gia finally gets there, but she's not in the office yet. And that's when, uh, what's her name? Uh, Amanda? She goes in there and, she, you know, uh, she's going to, they're waiting for Gia to come in. They're like, oh, read, read the papers, you know. And then the lawyer says, well, he changed his last will and testament of, you know, his, uh, he changed changed it, his last will, so um, that's why he was waiting for Gia to come in there, but tomorrow they're going to find out that uh, that Gia is going to be president and CEO of the company. Uh, uh, they find out that Amanda had an affair, you know, when she, she, she got at him drunk, you know, he was drunk and she helped him into his, his building and, you know, she kind of basically uh, seduced and raped him basically, or subduced him, just rode him on top of him, and supposedly had the kid, so we'll find out from the DNA test tomorrow. Um, the lawyers, you know, and 
Lucy's going to find out that, you know, Amanda and her son, you know, she's claiming that that's Adam's child. So we're going to find out tomorrow. Uh, you know, they're going to find out. And uh, I don't know, I'm thinking a couple more days of Lucy and Dana should be going and probably Manny too. People probably all going to jail for all, you know, the tangled web, the love triangle that was caused over the years of their 30 year marriage. So please tune in <laughs> and we'll figure this one out and uh, see, see the two go to jail, the three or four. Who knows, maybe Carol's gonna go to jail, Manny's gonna go to jail, Dana's gonna go to jail, Lucy's gonna go to jail, and uh, maybe Harry too, we might have a five pack, all go to jail. So, please wash your hands, stay safe. Salamat for all my people that uh, subscribe to me, I appreciate you all, and if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe, and uh, like I said, my wife's starting to feel better, so she'll be back on hers her pages um i'm filling in for her on her pages so uh or on her channels so please have a good day stay safe wash your hands uh wear the mask gloves and uh stay away from people you know you never know who has it and you don't want to find out when it's too late so just stay safe have a good day bye bye